Hello everyone, I'm KB and welcome to Clibit. Today I'm going to show you how you can download the original Windows 10 Home and Pro for free and there is two methods, one is direct link and one is by using the Microsoft software called the Media Creation Tool. So first let's go try with the Microsoft Media Creation Tool. So you go here website, I will put link in the description, go there and when you reach here and uh, you will see there is a download tool now option you just have to click that and after that when you are done downloading browse your downloaded folder where it has been downloaded media creation tool okay so then run it as administrator wait until it loads it will take few minutes it depends on your pc speed and network speed so it will check for your pc specs and etc things now it has loaded within a minute so it's saying getting few things ready now you will have to agree this term and condition just hit accept now you will have a two option upgrade this pc now or create an installation media for another pc so you can just straight upgrade your pc to windows 10 or you can just have a iso file so if you want to get an iso file create installation media select that option and hit next now uh, here you have to select your language after that addition and after that what architecture you want 32 bit or both or 64 bit so okay there is a one more last thing i forgot to mention and uh, there is a three option to choose from windows 10 windows 10 home single language and windows 10 n only so uh, windows 10 home single language means you will have a windows 10 home only if you select the windows 10 only which has nothing at all just windows 10 it means it will include windows 10 pro and home so while installation while you will be installing the windows it will ask whether you want to install the windows 10 pro or home so if you want to get the home or pro you just select this first windows 10 only and hit on next and you have to choose which media to use so you can just get a iso file or you can just use the usb flash drive if you have usb flash drive it will automatically burn this iso to usb drive or you can just have a iso file select on one of those options whatever you like to use just select iso file i'm gonna select the iso file and hit on next and it will say where you want to save i'm gonna save it in desktop and rename it as windows 10 and gonna hit save and you will see downloading windows 10 progress zero percent so it will be downloaded uh, the file size is 4 gigabyte so make sure you have a good connection or if you have a slow connection you can leave this download at night so uh, in the morning when you woke up just it will be finished downloading now let's jump into the second method second method is really easy and you don't have to uh, download any external software you can do it uh, just directly it will be downloaded directly it is also from the microsoft itself when you go here i will put link in the description go there and when you reach here you will see download windows 10 disk image iso file so you can also read everything you if you want to read then you have a option here select addition i'm gonna select the addition just like the windows 10 and then confirm and it will validate your request you have to wait for a moment and while it's checking something and uh, then you have a new option here which language you want to choose then select the english and then confirm and it will validate your request again and finally you have a option to windows 10 english edition uh, edition which edition you want to download 32 bit or the 64 so for example my pc supports the 64 i'm gonna click on 64 and it will take a few seconds and as you can see my idm has already picked the download and i'm gonna show you the file size actual file size as you can see the file size is 4 gigabytes so make sure you have a good connection if you don't have a good connection you can leave this download at night so in the morning you will have a full downloaded file okay now at the last let's talk about the users asked me a lot about this like uh, is this with is, is this include the key no it doesn't include any activation key or anything 
but while installation you can skip the key or you can always use windows 10 as long as you want without key but there will be the watermark uh, in the desktop calling or saying activate windows only so you can use as long as you want so it is not with, not with key and uh, it is only a original iso file from the microsoft so keep that in mind so that's all guys hope you enjoyed it if you did leave a like comment and subscribe and yeah i will see you in the next one take care yourself and have fun bye bye